we are going to learn about uh, a simple column chart uh, with a different coloring so what i mean to say over here is uh, so the data set which has been given to us uh, is name of the cities and the population in millions now let's say uh, we want to find out uh, for some cities the color should be different and for some other cities the color should be different now how do we do that uh, within a single chart so one thing is, is we can we can create a chart over here we can create a chart over here we can create a column chart over here and we can go to this individual individual stack and change the color over here but is that the idea uh, uh, the answer is no we want it to be dynamic saying that if my population is let's say about 50 million then my color should be different if my population is about uh, uh, less than 50 million then my color should be different so it should be dynamic it should not be static that I have to change color every time so how do we do that so first there is a simple technique uh, so there is uh, uh, there is nothing rocket science about it. Uh, it's just a uh, different representation of what we are actually trying to do with the uh, with the knowledge which we have so far. So what I'm going to do over here is I will select the cities in a, in a different cells. I will create uh, two separate columns. One is greater than 50 million and one is less than 50 million. Over here I will write a simple formula if my value is greater than 50 then I want to have this value else I want to see it as a zero all right and uh, I will simply drag this over here I will write the same formula if my value is less than 50 then I want to see the number else I want to see the zero you just have to note that in the same column or uh, or in both the columns you cannot have the number however in this column D both the columns have 0 0 because we have not signified what if my value is exactly 50 so which I can include it over here if my value is less than or equal to 50 then make my value as 50 okay so hi basically I have two columns which is ready which I have created from the original data set and then I simply select the data set and I will simply prepare the column chart over here and as you can see it automatically created two different coloring for the cities for city A, G and H who has a population of greater than 50 million it has created or it has uh, prepared a column chart whose color is blue and for the rest of the cities where for cities B, C, D, E and F where the population is less than or equal to 50 it has prepared a separate color as an orange so that's how and then we can name it the chart over here saying that uh, the population versus the city city versus population and uh, that's pretty much about it as in it's more like a dynamic thing over here so if I change the population of city from 15 to 115 over here my formula will change and over here my chart will also change so that's the unique thing about this thing uh, about this method however one thing we have to notice if I have too many if conditions over here if it's greater than 50 and less than 60 and greater than 60 and less than 70 then this chart will not be feasible this chart will just prolong itself so this chart will not be feasible under such circumstances so that's pretty much about this video thank you